right, new day. Let me take a look and see if anything is ready for harvest. It is not. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go buy. I'm going to go buy some more wheat. I guess that's it. I don't really need to buy anything else for right now. So we'll go buy wheat, we'll make the flour, and then we'll get all that setted, settled. And then we're going to go check out a turtle. Come over here to Timmy. Even though it costs me money to do this, it will actually give me more money when I sell it. Timmy also sells those spears. I think I, I think we already knew that, but in case anybody new is joining, he sells the spears that give us our magic powers. So let's do some shopping. We'll do the wheat. Oh, not that much. Why? Come on. Don't really need anything else right now, so go with that. And we'll sell the flower. Go ahead and put the flower in our cell box. That'll be for tomorrow, though. So I'll put that in here. I'll put this down here, because I don't need that. So that's $2,000. If I was just to sell the wheat as it was, I think it's like $1,500. So it's like an extra $500, because we made it into something else. And we only paid like $200 to turn it into flour. So it actually, we're, we're gaining like $300, I think, is how that works. Eventually I might make something more than wheat, but right now that's what we have. And then we need to water all this stuff before we can go. So go get some water. Oh, it lets me do more spaces. That's good. That's kind of- that's convenient. It's not convenient for me have, because I've squared this weird, but that's okay. I'll go ahead and water these plots, even though there's nothing there, because I don't know. Um, I don't want them to go away. I still haven't quite figured out the rules to that yet, because I always put plants in there, but I'm trying to keep my plants separate. We'll come down here and do these. Oh man, this is so much easier than what than having to do it one by one. I kind of wish farming was this easy in real life because I would totally do it if it could get me money. Unfortunately, it's not that simple. Okay, that's done. I will say lately, I've started to take in an affinity to um, plants. And I've started to collect plants. I don't know why, because I'm not good with plants. Most of my plants die. <laughs> but for some reason, I started collecting plants. I have like a couple of them now. I got like money plants and stuff like that, bamboo plants. They're doing all right. All right, so our next goal is to go get, um, or go look at this turtle. I think that's our next thing. Let me check. Yeah, that's the only quest I have right now. So I guess that's what we'll go do. So we need to go north. Actually, let me look at something Oh, not that. What do I need to get my next sword? 25... Is that sap? 25 sap to get a veteran sword. And 5,000. Alright, well for right now I'm going to go with what I have. 
I'm saving it because I know when we see the pumpkin uh, person, it's like 3,000 for a backpack upgrade, and I really need a backpack upgrade. So we're gonna go to the forest sanctuary. See, this is a checkpoint, but I can't teleport from here. It's just a checkpoint. Poison tree. I kind of don't want to fight anything in here. There's nothing in here that will fight me except for these poison trees, and I don't really want to fight them. So I'm just going to try to move past them. Um, these golem guys, if you're too close to where you're fighting, um, they'll start healing them because they're like forest protectors. And then that's when you set everything on fire <laughs> with my magic fire whirly, whirly tornado. Mountain tunnel entrance. Is that where we need to be? I... No, no, I went the wrong way, didn't I? I'm supposed to go to the swamp. I went the wrong way. I could have... I don't know if I had a checkpoint to the swamp. Tunnel entrance is not where we need to go. The swamp is over here. The swamp is full of poisonous crap. It's not fun. It's not a fun place to be. These guys are in here though. And while these guys don't poison you, they hit something that makes you go slow, but they have the hard shells that I need to get the upgraded gear, so I will kill kill these dudes. Let's see. The problem is I don't know I don't really know my way around. Shield bugs. Is it this? No, this is a dead end. It's this way. I don't think we've gotten to the area. We haven't even been there yet, so this will be a new area altogether. I don't want to fight that guy. Those guys are just bad news. This is a dead end. Um, that's a dead end too. Is it over here? It's over here. Go through here. You can see that there was a teleport um, stone there, but that is just to like to teleport out. So that's not going to help me. Oh my gosh. Maybe it's over... Is it over here, maybe? Because I think if I go down, it was a different way. So let me see what's over here. Blue Moon Lake. Oh, okay. We've made it. What is that? Is that a... Okay. Flower Pixies. So these guys are not aggro. I'm good. Oh, the gooeys are out here. Is that the turtle? That's probably the turtle. I'm gonna open this. That's the turtle, isn't it? Oh, he's... Oh my gosh, he's... Is he an aggro? Is he chasing me? Dude, don't chase me. I'm wondering if I... <laughs> if I start attacking him, are all these pixies gonna start attacking me too? Okay, so there's nothing out here but this guy, so... Oh my gosh. Ooh! Let's... Okay, let's try to kill him. I don't think I can. Look how tough this dude is. One hit from him is gonna kill me. Big 
big AoEs. Look at that. I mean, he's on fire. Maybe if I, as long as I stay locked on, it'll probably be okay. He's like freaking out. Oh god. I made some pixies mad. <laughs> oh no! Oh, I don't have enough mana. Dang it. This sucks. Oh my god. Eat all the candies. All right, he's on fire. That's good. Almost got him though. We almost got him. Why are you not dead yet? Please die. Oh, he died. He died. Now I just have to. Oh, crap. Dang it. I don't think I picked up the shell, and I rolled out of the level. Crap! I guarantee that it's not there anymore. I'm gonna have to fight this guy again. Oh no! Did it keep it? Well, it gave me a leaf. I bet I didn't get it. Oh, I did get it! Oh, sweet! Oh, thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Okay. Um, let's eat this. So I guess I'm getting the leaves off of the fairies? Is that what we're getting leaves off of? Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, I'm dead. <laughs> well, it's a quick way to get back. <laughs> but we got the shell. That's the main thing. We got the freaking shell. So now we should go back to our house, right? Yes. Uh, it's 7 o'clock, so it's dark. I don't know if the place, if Shamrock will be available, but let's check. I mean, if anything, I can appreciate, like, if you die and you're not at, like, the inn, um, it'll checkpoint you back to your house. So when I get, like, too far away and I don't want to deal with running all the way back or trying to find a teleport, I can just, um, die. Get myself killed. Okay, he's not there, so we will have to go sleep and talk to him in the morning. But before we do that, we have to clear out our inventory. 
So let me see what's in here. We didn't collect too much stuff this run. I got another key. I never did figure out what happened to my um, copper key. I definitely did get one. But even watching back through the videos, I'm guessing that I just opened a chest, maybe, and it just automatically used the key instead of asking me. That's the only thing I can think of that happened there. Okay. Well, I don't think I have enough hard shells yet to get that gear. For right now, I'm going to put this key away. Until I can figure out what I want to use it on so I don't accidentally use it again. And we're going to go sleep. I didn't check to see if Pumpkin was there, but oh well, it'll be okay. I'll 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 get to I'll get Pumpkin eventually. And sleep. Alright, nice. Uh, it looks like we have some foods that are ready to be harvested. Oh, and this thing is here. I like how rocks just magically appear. I can understand if it was like weeds or, um, or wood, like because sticks, you know, fall from down from the trees. But where the heck are these rocks coming from? All these, I think, are worth only five points, though. Yeah. I know you can cook stuff, but we haven't- I haven't really learned a lot of cooking, um, cooking things yet. Okay, Shamrock. Here you go. Yeah, he was making dynamite. So what we found was there's like a, a cave system, but it was like covered with rock and we couldn't get through it. So we came to ask this guy if uh, there was any way like he knew how to open it. And he said the only way was to do dynamite. So we were trying to get the ingredients for dynamite, which was apparently coal, which that made sense. Um, a turtle shell, I don't know why, and then there was like some rocks and wood that we needed. Okay, so we got our- we got the dynamite. Let's do some shopping here. Let's see. Let's do potatoes. So I need nine. Nine potatoes. Um... We'll do nine strawberries. Did I have three spots open? I think so. Onions. Fine. Throw these in the ground before we uh before we leave. And put that back. Do I Um do I want to take anything with me? I don't think so, because we're heading up north, so let's I'll just leave it empty for right now. I don't have any food. That's a problem. Let's stop by the, um, what's her name? I don't even remember her name, but there's the little doggy up here. Was it Apple? Yeah, Miss Apple. Let us buy... See, I can't buy these things, because I have to make them. Well, we'll just buy croissants. That's ten points. Um, so I'll buy ten of them. And then what we'll do is we'll set those, shortcut those into here. Eventually I will have to start making food to make, like, the stuff that I need. Okay, let's head up north again. We're gonna head to the forest sanctuary. And this time we're gonna go north instead of west. And that'll take us to that tunnel entrance. And we'll see what dynamite does when you stick it in there. <laughs>
All these guys, Forest Guardian guys, are good for sap, but when they're all close together like that, they're just gonna heal each other. So the fire spells really help up here. Alright, here we are. Oh, here's that this dude that we never see until until plot points show up. What should we do now? Let's put the uh, dynamite. Setting the dynamite. Maybe, just maybe, I will chant a spell right after you put the dynamite in front of the boulder. Who knows? It might work that way. Um, okay, if you think that that works, that's fine. There are a lot of rocks up here that we can collect that have ore in them. It's actually good ore. Silver. I think there's some gold stuff, too. That will help us down the road when we're trying to make um, better weapons. So I'll grab all this before I do that. There's also a teleport stone up here too that, uh, for whatever reason, only works one way. I see that there's a chest over here, but I don't have the keys with me. Copper key. Okay. How do I do this? Interact. That is a lot of dynamite. Okay, let's try it. Is he really gonna- what? Just light it. Fire spell! But that- that didn't do it. It didn't do anything! That was like a little poof! <laughs> What's happening? Oh, bump the mic. Oh, it's a- Was a golem sitting there? Oh, okay. Am I gonna have to fight it? Gonna have to fight it. Ooh. I like how his name is Angry Golem instead of just Golem. <laughs> he's almost gone. And he's done. And we got a key off of him, which is over. If I can open this. <laughs> Oh, it won't let me. Come on, cutscene. We should keep our eyes and ears open. For now, we'd better tell the others that the passage is finally open. So we don't- Oh, well, we don't even get to go in there? Well, that's a shame. We got an achievement for it. Now I can open this. Oh, wow, 3,000 pennies. Well, this kind of sucks. I can't... These aren't choppable, right? No. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna go back. Uh, wait a minute. Before I do that, where are we going back to? Okay, Paul Village. 